as Hindus across Trinidad and Tobago joined with Indian communities worldwide on Sunday to celebrate Lord Ram's return to Adiodia. With the reopening of Ram's Mandir in India, Shigwanas, Mayor Faik Mohammed noted something of significance within his own borough that serves as a representation of the country. And in Shigwanas, precisely along Monroe Road, one can witness the coexistence of a temple, a church, a masjid in close proximity. This, this is an extraordinary testament to the harmonious living that defines our community. It is but just one example. Frequently, we encounter discussions on the American dream, the Singapore model, the life in London. I say it is high time the world turns its attention to Trinidad and Tobago for a model for coexistence. Mayor Mohammed said that Lord Ram's life serves as a guiding light to ethical living in today's contemporary world. He encouraged Hindus to use this religious occasion to reflect on ways in which they could incorporate this revered figure's teachings into their own lives. In Hinduism, Lord Ram exemplifies ideals of justice, righteousness, and unwavering commitment to truth even in the face of adversity. His inclusive leadership serves as a vital lesson for contemporary leaders, illustrating the significance of fairness and equality in governance. In a world marked by social and political divisions, his example encourages leaders to rise above differences and work towards the common good. Naming the various religions, Mayor Muhammad emphasized that to be a good follower of any, you must first be a good human being. The event, which was held at the Pear Road Recreation Ground in Felicity, Shikonas, is being likened to another Diwali. India's High Commissioner to Trinidad and Tobago, Dr. Pradeep Rajapurit, praised what he described as a vibrant and devoted Indian diaspora in Trinidad and Tobago for preserving the cultural heritage of the motherland throughout the years. <laughs> 